أكبر الله أكبر الله أكبر الله أكبر أشهد أن لا إله إلا الله أشهد أن لا إله إلا الله أشهد أن محمد رسول الله أشهد أن محمد رسول الله هيا على الصلاة هيا على الصلاة هيا على الفلاة هيا على الفلاح الله أكبر الله أكبر لا إله إلا الله Can we invite Rabbi Nagin to Ramadan Karim Yom Atzmut Sameach in Israel among our most sacred sites are our hospitals. Um, hospitals are the places where encountering suffering and pain we discover the common humanity that connects us all. We, the divisions between Jews, Muslims, Christians, Druze, between Israelis and Palestinians, we overcome these to connect together, to, uh, to, to work together to overcome, overcome the suffering there. Today, the entire world, the entire world is a hospital. And in this hospital, we, um, we have to, in our working together to overcome, or take responsibility to overcome these challenges. In this hospital, my hope is, and this prayer, we will, after the curse of this plague is beyond us, that the truth we have discovered of our common humanity will remain with us. So perhaps a, a, a parak of, of, from the book of Psalms in, in Hebrew, um, appropriate for for this crisis. Shir la malot esay na yalari meayin yavo ezri ezri meim adenai ose shemayin biades al yiten bemot ragrecha al yanum shomrecha Yishmar et nafsotecha, Adonai yishmar et seitecha vrecha, Me'ata v'adonam. Thank you so much, Toda, Shukran, and uh, welcome to everybody joining around the world to the Abrahamic Reunion's Unity Prayer for the Holy Land where we gather people from all faiths all around the world to offer prayers in solidarity with all those faiths in the Holy Land, all those people in the Holy Land, and knowing that the Holy Land is the earth. And it's, it's my privilege to introduce our meeting. My name is Chris Miller, and I'm working as an administrator for the AR and helping organize these prayers. Uh, An Abrahamic reunion, or AR, is a group of 
peace builders working to bring people together, to know each other better, to understand each other better with on the ground programs in the Holy Land, in Israel and in Palestine, to bring the many faiths together and share the common heritage of the Abrahamic faiths. There's so much more that joins than separates. And our two moderators for the meetings and for the whole series are Sheikh Ghassan Manasra, our international director, Sheikh in the Qadri Order of Peace from the Holy Land, living now in, in Florida, and David Les Shahabuddin, one of the Abrahamic Reunion's co-founders and the U.S. board chairman, teacher of meditation and conflict resolution and, and peace studies for decades as well. So uh, Sheikh Ghassan and uh, David, <clears throat> pleasure to welcome you to begin the meeting. You know, the Abrahamic reunion, what is it really? People always ask me. The Abrahamic reunion is just what we've seen and what we're seeing now. It's people. It's not the organization, it's people. People who have hearts and feelings and prayers and depth and recognize in each other the one. So it's people and an opportunity for our souls and spirit to express that. So that's my introduction. Thank you all. This is so beautiful. And I, I would like to introduce my colleague, uh, the great Sheikh Ghassan Manasra, please. Assalamu alaikum, shalom alaikum, peace be upon you. Thank you, Shahabuddin. It was great to uh, 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 open the prayer. We have confused in the beginning of this meeting, but it's okay. Uh, 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 welcome again to the uh, garden because we plant the seeds long, long ago together, you and us, and we will begin uh, soon uh, uh, to uh, introduce our uh, sheikhs and the rabbis and imams and uh, uh, priests uh, to pray with us today. I would like to uh, introduce Sheikh Muwafak Tarif. Sheikh Muwafak Tarif uh, uh, is the current spiritual leader of the Druze community in Israel. Tarif was born in 1963 in the city of Julis. Since 1753, his family has been leading the Druze community in mandatory Palestine and then Israel. In 1993, he inherited uh, the, the position of spiritual leader from the grandfather, Sheikh Amin Tarif. And really, it's our uh, uh, pleasure to have Sheikh Tarif to uh, 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 say his prayer. يشرفنا ويسعدنا أن ندعو الشيخ موفق طريف ذلك الشيخ السلام في أن يكون معنا وأن يقرأ صلاته معنا تفضل شيخ موفق بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم طبعا في هذا الشهر والذي تعانقت فيه العياد نهنئ جميع المحتفلين من إخواننا اليهود والمسيحيين بيد الفسر المجيد وأبناء الطائفة الدرزية بزيارة مقام سيدنا شعيب عليه السلام ومناسبة حلول شهر رمضان المبارك أتقدم باسم الجميع باسم أبناء الطائفة إلى الأخوة المسلمين وإلى جميع المؤمنين بأحر التهاني والتبريكات وأطيب التمنيات متمنيا للجميع صياما مقبولا ومباركا وأن يعيده الله عز وجل أن يعيد هذا الشهر المبارك على الجميع بالخير واليوم والبركة والسعادة آمنين أن ينقشع I will translate, I will translate if it's okay <laughs> بدي أترجم سيدي. آه. حبيبي. In in this time when the holidays hugging one another, I want to bless the Jews for their fast and also the Christians and for the Jews for their visiting the tomb of Nabi Shoaib and for the Muslims for Ramadan. It's it's a great signs for all of us from all all around the world to see these holidays come to hug together to be together. تفضل يا شيخ. آملين أن ينقشع وباء الكورونا المقيت ونقول في هذا هذا الدعاء. And 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 we we pray that this corona will go quickly because it's very hard for us and we will say this prayer. Please, تفضل شيخ. اللهم إني متوجه في هذا الدعاء إليك متكلا دوما عليك. اللهم اكتب لنا الخير والتوفيق في كل الأمور وأجعل برحمتك لكل مهموم من راحة 
ولكل حزين سعادة ولكل مريض شفاء ولكل داء دواء. I I will say God we all of us we are our hearts to you and we we ask you to make for all of these heart all of these people from their sick sickness healing and to send lots of blessings and love to all of these people. اللهم انقذ عالمنا وقد عم وباء الكورونا الضروب وأغلقت الدول أبوابها وتعاظمت أصوات الكروب وضعف الإنسان أمام حكمك وأستغاثت بك الشعوب. God, we ask you to really protect us from this virus corona, from this coronavirus, and we saw that all the countries closed their borders and we ask you, please, uh, uh, give us the life again to move, to, to connect together. اللهم ها نحن ندعوك اليوم دعاء المضطرين ونرجوك رجاء المتوكلين طالبين أمنا بعد خوف وصحة بعد ابتلاء وجمعا بعد تفريق وقربا بعد بعد. God, we, we pray for you, we ask you, we uh, uh, trying for you to really to bless us and to give us the... Uh, a quiet, the safeness, the holiness, and give us to be quiet in this world. اللهم ابعث رحمة تشفي المرضى والموجوعين وتعيد السكينة والرضا إلى قلوب الخائفين. God sent us a, 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 a grace from you to heal all of these uh, sick people and also give us a, a happiness. To, to come back again as very happy people. Allahumma inna abwaab al-khalawat wal kanais qad uglikat wa madakhil al-masajid wal kunus qad uqfilat wa hakamad da' ala aswat al-musallin fa sakatat. God, all of the uh, houses, your houses is closed, like the churches, the khulwas, the uh, mosques, and, and all of the uh, prayers, no one hear the prayers of the uh, 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 believers. God, give us again to hear these uh, people pray again. Allahumma lan ta'ud illa in amart fa furijat. Allahumma ij'al al-samah fi hadhi al-ayyam aqwa khisalana wa rizqna al-sidiq wa rizqa fi aqwalina wa afalina wa a'atina al-quwa hatta nusamih wa na'fu. God, there is no way except to be moderate. As human beings, we need to moderate. We need to forgive one another and to be as one family. If we will not do it, we will lose ourselves. Yeah. Yeah. God, we have today, these days, the house of love. If we will have the house of love, all of us will be great and we will heal and we will be together. And I say, God, you are the peace, and from you come the peace, to you will go the peace. Uh, send us grace and love. Amen, amen, amen. طبعا شكرا للاخ غسان ولكل المشاركين وان شاء الله الشهر الفضيل بنعاد جميع فادات البال. Amen, amen. Uh, I thank uh, Ghassan and all of you together for uh, uh, this great prayers that you are doing. And I pray this month, holy month, we come again with a happiness. مولانا وشيخنا نشكرك شكرا جميلا وجزيلا على حقيقة هذا الدعاء العميق الذي يعني لامس قلوبنا. Thank you, Sheikh Muwafak Tari, for this great and deep prayer that it touched our hearts. Thank you. شكرا. شكرا. ابقى معنا. شاب الدين. Yeah. Please. Invite the the father to to pray. Father Jamil Khader. Is the pastor of the Good Shepherd Episcopal Church in Nablus, in Palestine. He's a strong ally in the interfaith peace movement and has been part of the Abrahamic Reunion Palestine events for the last two years, hosting the January 2019 multi faith text study. He has been the pastor of Good Shepherd Church for almost five years and an eloquent and elegant human being. Father Jamil.
Yes, uh, hello everyone and uh, good evening. I hope you are hearing me very well. Uh, thank you very much for uh, this invitation and uh, to joining you all uh, in this wonderful uh, meeting to, uh, to call God together and pray to God uh, from different religions. Uh, as, uh, as you introduced me, thank you very much for your uh, welcoming words for me. I'm Father Jamil from Palestine, uh, Nablus especially, the Church of the Good Shepherd and the St. Philip's Anglican Church, a priest in charge uh, since almost three years. And uh, almost, uh, I was uh, serving in Jordan and in Lebanon. Uh, thank you. Uh, first of all, uh, I, uh, I really want to say Ramadan Karim for the whole Muslims friends who start their uh, fasting before five days. Uh, and also happy Easter for all the Christians uh, who are uh, celebrate the uh, Orthodox Christian last Sunday and before two weeks the uh, Western uh, also Easter and also uh, we are uh, I am so happy to be here today uh, with you uh, they asked me to do a small a small prayers uh, from the Palestinians who are living in the Holy Land uh, and this prayers for the uh, whole uh, world and um, and for also the, uh, especially for the uh, unstable uh, uh, or unsettled world we have it uh, in this time. Uh, and uh, really we are facing a lot of uh, difficulties, uh, especially uh, in our thought and in our minds. And uh, we have to be as a leaders in the churches, we have to be uh, a leaders who are support the people and encourage them in their faith, especially they uh, are asking a lot of questions about where is God in all of these things? And uh, uh, is he awake or is he there? Uh, and uh, I will pray these prayers in English also. And um, please, I would like from you all to close your eyes and uh, let's pray together. Our heavenly God, the creator of the whole world and the preserver of all humankind, we humbly beseech you for all source, sorts and conditions of people everywhere that you would be pleased to make your ways known unto us. Your saving health into all nations in the whole world. May you be lead into the way of truth, in the unity of spirit, and in the bond of peace, and in the righteousness of life. We commend to your goodness all those who are in any ways afflicted or distressed especially in their minds and body and states, especially in the cases we are facing now with the coronavirus attack the whole world. And we are really suffering everyone that it may please you to confirm and relieve us according to, their, to our several necessities, giving us passion under, their, under our suffering and a happy issues out of all our affliction. Our Lord and our Father who are hearing always your people, your creature, help us to face this problem and to keep your faith in our hearts. We are knowing you will be within us and in us in the whole problems we face it in this world. Please be with us and help us to always reflect your love and reflect your work and deeds in this world. Amen. Thank you, Father. 
uh, the meal. It was so deep and great. I thank you very well. So I'm going to introduce Naja Kabaha. Mm -hmm. And she is the leader of the Muslim community in Israel, a leader in the Muslim community in Israel, working for interfaith, interfaith connection for so many years. She's in the Sufi order, the Sufi peace order. And the most important thing that any of us can do, she is doing, she is teaching the young children for they represent our future. Najak Kabaha, please. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. Wabihi nasta'in wa alayhi natawakkal. Bismillah. Wa salatu wa salam ala al-Qafir al-Qalq wa al-Mursaleen. Sayyidna. Ya tarjmi. Sallallahu alayhi wa salam. Atini wa salam. In the name of God. Uh, 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 we trust God and uh, the uh, uh, prayer upon the Prophet Muhammad. Tfadal, <laughs> حيث قال الله تعالى في كتابه العزيز في سورة الانشراح فإن مع العسر يسرى إن مع العسر يسرى This disease is revealed to, to the world, this world but I want to tell you something that all of the believers all around the world and the, the people love the prophets especially the Muslims love Prophet Muhammad and to send Jesus and Jesus Moses and all the prophets God will help them uh, to, to be quiet and to be uh, safe. And there is a verse in the Quran say, with the bad or the hard times, you will find a quiet time and very safe time. فقال له الصحابة ادعوا لنا يا رسول الله بالرخاء فقال لهم الشدة الشدة فقالوا له أتدعو لنا بالشدة ودعوتك تستجاب فقال لهم لأن ما بعد الشدة إلا الرخاء uh, uh, You know, in, in each uh, challenge, in each uh, danger, in each uh, encounter, encountering and uh, dealing with these uh, uh, things uh, God will send us reward, gifts. God needs from these things to teach us, to tell us that there is a very important thing for us as a human being. And it's taken from the uh, uh, hadith of the Prophet Muhammad. One day, they, uh, the, the, on the time of the Prophet Muhammad, they had a very uh, challenged time. And the Sahaba, the companions of the Prophet Muhammad came to him and they asked him, Oh, Prophet Muhammad, can you pray for us, for God to to, to, to reveal all of this and to, to, to send all of this uh, problem challenges back, he say, no. Hardness, hardness, hardness. And they say, why? He said, because after the hardness will come a new day, will come a new time. From here, we, he, we need to pray. He, we need to pray from a very clean heart, and I will pray. Fadl, but Jubal Kasiri. Fadl. Allahumma inna nas'aluka bi maqaid al-'izzat min arshik. God, we ask you. Wa muntaqa rahmati min kitabik. God, we ask you. Wa bi ismik al-'adham. Wa bi ismik al-'adham. Yeah, yeah. God, we ask you in 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 the uh, closest place, closest seating next to your throne and we ask you in your uh, great name mm -hmm. and in the complete, yeah and the complete uh, 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 speech your speech and complete your speech yeah. god uh, uh, create a new way uh, create a new day uh, uh, delete all of our uh, sadness. 
and God uh, forgive our sins. Allahumma ya man yahulu bain al-abdi wa qalbi. God, when, uh, you sometimes create a gap between the uh, a person and his heart, her heart. Yeah. Hul bainana wa bain had bain al-insaniya fi jamaa wa bain had al-waba bi hiyalika wa kudratika ya khair al-qadirin. Make a, a distance between all the human beings and this disease in your power, God. Hmm. God, I ask you in my name, in the name of this uh, uh, woman, she is a fast and she is a prey in a very pure heart and in your uh, 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 strength to uh, finish all of this uh, uh, disease. Allahumma adfa' sharra hadha al-waba' an al-insaniya fi jam'a' bijahi salaa' ala rasulillah wa sallallahu alayhi wa sallam wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam Wa kuli ameen, Mr. Bil-Akhir God Ameen, طب God push all of these disease, all of these challenges, all of these dangers in this world and give us a life and revelations Ameen Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Najah, for this great and deep prayer. Thank you. We appreciate that. Thank you very much. Thanks. Shukran. Now, I think we will go to our Rabbi, Rabbi Yaakov Nagin, Rabbi Dr. Yaakov Meir Nagin, born June 17, 1967. Uh, is an Israel rabbi and author. Nagin teaches at uh, uh, Yeshivat Otiniel and has written extensively uh, about Jewish philosophy and Talmud. He is the co-chairman of the Israeli board of Abrahamic Reunion and a leader in interfaith peace initiative between uh, Judaism and Islam and in encounters between Judaism and Eastern religions. Uh, it's our pleasure to invite Rabbi Nagin to uh, 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 pray with us and to give his life to uh, the world. And inshallah, God will accept his prayer. Rabbi Nagin, please. Thank you. Ramadan Karim, it is good to be together with you today, all of you, many, many friends of the past and people connecting to for the first time today. I would like to begin with the prayer of the Chief Rabbinate of Israel in response to the Corona crisis. And this prayer, I will say in English, and afterwards from the ancient prayer uh, in Hebrew of Avinu Malkenu. God of the first and of the last, God of all creatures, Lord of all generations. He arouses those who, who sleep and awaken those who slumber. He heals the sick, opens the eyes of the blind, and raises those who are bowed down. We come before you with a bowed head and with a bent stature and plead. Hundreds of thousands have died, millions fallen sick, Save, we beseech you, O Lord. We entreat thee, O Lord. Send prosperity. Send recovery to the sick. Avert the plague from your world. Please, God, you have nursed us in famine and provided us with plenty. You have removed us from pestilence and freed us from severe and long-lasting disease. Help us. Your mercy has aided us and your kindness has not abandoned us. We plead and request before you to heal us, Lord, and we will be healed. Save us and we will be saved, for you are our glory. May the words of our mouth and meditation of our hearts be pleasing before you, O Lord, our rock and our redeemer. 
And now from the ancient prayer Avinu Malkeinu that was instituted thousands of years ago, also in times of crisis. Avinu Malkeinu Chatanu Lifanecha Avinu Malkeinu Ein Lanu Melech Ela Ota Avinu Malkeinu Osei Manu Leman Shemecha Avinu Malkeinu Mena Megefa Mi Olamecha Avinu Malkeinu Shlach Refua Shlema Lecholei Amecha Avinu Malkeinu Shma Koleinu Chos Rachem Aleinu Avinu Malkeinu Kabel Brachamim Abratso Estibila Seinu Avinu Malkeinu Tach Sharei Shamayim Lefila Seinu Avinu Malkeinu Te'e Asha Hazot Shat Rachamim Ve'et Ratzon Milfanecha Avinu Malkeinu Chaneinu Ve'aneinu Ki Ein Banu Masim Osei Manu Tzedaka Ve'chesed Ve'hoshienu let me end with a personal prayer. Suffering is one of the greatest, our greatest teachers. And the great hope and prayer is from this suffering, we will have the wisdom to take the right lessons. Lessons about our common humanity. Lessons about our common responsibility lessons about our dependence and interdependence upon one another, lessons about the sacredness of human life, and lessons about humility in front of forces that are beyond our control and that are greater than us. Thank you. Thank you. It was very deep prayer. I hope God will accept all of our prayers. Chavudin, do you want to say something before I will close? Because I want to say something. Please, do you want to say something? Yes. Please. Please. <clears throat> you know, recently, we have been asked to separate, to wear masks, mm. to not go out. And we very willingly said, okay, this is for our protection. This will help us. And we're listening to that authority. But there is a much greater and infinite authority that is asking us, that is ordering us to pray. The authority, represented by all smaller authority. It is not our choice. It is our duty to pray. It doesn't matter how we pray. It doesn't matter what comes out of our mouth what matters is that the prayer is present in our hearts. There are infinite beings throughout the universe just waiting to help us, to heal us, to bring us together. Mm -hmm. So what we have today is just a microcosm of the whole world and of the universe. And what is prayer? Prayer is saying, I will, I will accept the help. I will accept the love that is my own being. I will accept the reality that each of us is connected. Every human being, every animal, every plant, every grain of sand, every bit of water in the oceans and rivers, we are that. We are that. So let our prayers be a joyous song unto the Lord. And let us get past the suffering of this moment. Amen. Thank you, Shabbat. Wow. Thank you, Shabbat. Amen. 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 Thank you. I really, it's it's very deep. It's uh, uh, telling us a lot. Uh, I I want to say something. It, this is the time, as all of them say, to pray from a very pure heart, 
to be transparent, to be a very, very quiet and to be like, you know, that glass, each one can see through you and can see you and can see themselves through you. You, you need to be the one. And I, I will say to Shabudin, yes, microcosmos, but I think we began to be the macrocosmos now as the complete creation, as even Arabs say, 13th century, it's very important to be the macro and to be the strongest and to see one another. I, 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 I saw in Europe how they began to hug one another. They began to go to the mosques to, to pray with the Muslims and the Muslims began to, you know, uh, uh, spread food to, to the uh, Christian Jews. Jews began to help the Christians and Muslims and the same thing, all the, the world began to know one another. As we say, as Shahabuddin last time say, this is, this is uh, the time that uh, it, all of the world began to be quiet and the world began to be quiet. Why? Because all of this rush will stop and we will begin to discover ourselves, to explore ourselves. We need to create the internal journeys, our journeys. I think it was so great prayers. Thank you all. I would like to thank Sheikh Muafat Tarif for his deep prayer and to thank uh, 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 Sheikha uh, Najah Kabha, uh, she, she, she say a very great prayer, a very deep prayer. Uh, uh, Father uh, uh, Jamil, he is so great and pure prayer, deep prayer, and uh, Rabbi Yaakov Nagin, uh, 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 you know, uh, he, he did a very great uh, job. And I think this prayer, Shahabuddin, uh, I, and all of the uh, clergy, I think we create a very great basil together. We are the same, all of us, we are the same with a different language, different nationality, different uh, religion, different faith, different, I don't know. But in our essences, we are still human beings and we are the same. We are brothers, sisters, one family and beautiful family. Uh, I will say in Hebrew or something, I would say, להודות גם לפאדר ג'מיל, אני להודות לשייח מואפק טריף, זה היה ממש חזק מאוד, תודה לכם מקרב לב. I will say something in Arabic and to, to finish. שוכרן ג'זילן לכם ג'מיען. חקיקתן כאן שייען ג'מילן לשייח הנג'ח כבאה, חקת בסדקן ובעומקן, וכדאליק שייח מואפק טריף, תחדת מן קלב עמיך, וכדאליק רב יעקב נגן, والأب جميل من نابلس شكرا لكم جميعا إن شاء الله سنلتقي our meeting next meeting will be May 12th next meeting will be May 12th and we will meet again as we say 6 o'clock Israel and Palestine time and our time 11 o'clock May, yeah. May 13th May 13th, ah, May 13th. Wednesday. Wednesday Wednesday May 13th uh, we change it yeah we, we will be Wednesday May 13th إن شاء الله next time we will see you and we'll be with you together. We love you so much. And inshallah, for next me meeting and praying, pray from today until the next meeting. We will hear your prayer, your prayers in our hearts. Thank you. Love you, Salim. Thanks. Amen. Amen, amen, amen. 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 Yes. Akbar, can, can you make the, uh, uh, yeah, 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 okay, thank you. Thanks everybody for coming and just a little info card if you'd like to support the work of Abrahamic Reunion, you can find information on our website and you can send us contact to be part of our mailing list and we'll keep you updated on all of these upcoming Zoom prayers and all the programs on the ground, so. Salam, shalom, peace.